Welcome back. Time now for the Heat Index and this morning's hot button, Modern Family star Ariel Winter opening up about her breasts reduction surgery, revealing in an exclusive interview with Glamour.com the physical and emotional pain she was dealing with. ABC's Lindsay Davis has that story for us. Second highest in the class. Hey. Well, that's She's great. best known as the nerdy yet lovable middle sister Alex Dunphy on Modern Family. But this morning, Aria Winter is opening up about her deeply personal choice to undergo breast reduction surgery this summer, going from a size 32F to a 34D just after wrapping season and seven of her hit ABC show. In an interview with Glamour.com, 17-year-old winner shares the struggle that led to her decision, saying, the internet bullies are awful. I could post a photo where I feel good and 500 people will comment about how fat I am and that I'm disgusting. Also discussing the physical pain of having a large chest, saying, I had a lot of back problems. It started to hurt so bad that I couldn't take the pain. She wanted to be able to kind of just set the record straight, talk all about it, so then it's out there and kind of answers every kind of question. The physical pain got so bad that she couldn't even stand up. Every time she'd go online, she'd see some really horrible things. I don't know how you don't have a meltdown every day. Winter telling Glamour, one of the few people she confided in before the surgery, her TV mom, Julie Bowen. They're so close. She felt really comfortable to open up. Julie was really the only co-star that knew what she had been going through. Breast Breast reduction surgeries are on the rise. According to the American Society for Aesthetic Plastic Surgery, nearly 115,000 women underwent the procedure last year. Some of the benefits of breast reduction surgery are feeling better about yourself physically and emotionally, and having more self-confidence to walk around and move in the world. Winter is hoping sharing her story will inspire others, saying, it's something that I did to better my life and better my health, and I think that can benefit a lot of young girls. Girls, I have felt happier with myself than I ever have. For Good Morning America, Lindsay Davis, ABC News. Yeah. Oh my. And we are joined now by Cindy Levy, editor in chief of Glamour Hi. Magazine. Good to see you here. You Cindy. too. A lot of reaction. Yeah. From, what, 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 what most part from your readers? Incredibly positive. I mean, everybody is saying, listen, it's great that she came out and said, you know, that she did this and why she did it and mm -hmm. that she feels better about her body. My favorite comment actually was on our Facebook page. One of our readers wrote, you know what? This is your decision. I always loved you as an actress and for your voice. Your chest is your business. Yeah, yeah. I love putting well it like said. that. Yeah. 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 Really well mm. said. You know, it's interesting. She didn't tell many of her family members. She told her TV mom, as we just right. mm -hmm. Claire Dunphy, obviously. Um, but I'm curious, in her decision to talk to Glamour, I mean, it's a very brave and courageous thing to do. It, it was. I mean, her sister, she said, was a big um, source of support to her and many members of her family and her boyfriend. I think she came to Glamour because we do take pains to cover these issues in a respectful way, and there is a really sensational way that you could tell a story like this with before and after pictures mm -hmm. and I think what she wanted was just to share what she was going through inside mm -hmm. and and by the way there's a bigger issue here she was really getting beaten up on social media right. she would post yeah. a picture yeah. of herself that she thought she looked great in and I'm sure she did look great in immediately there would be 500 comments from people About saying, saying well your breasts look too big or yeah, you look fat that you look fat or so you know wrong. look at her really breasts wrong. and I mean that that is appalling and a whole separate issue that she I love that with. she yeah. wants to help other girls too because the shaming part the body shaming part of this is is present for a lot of people. Yeah, and, and the physical pain. I mean, she's very careful to say, and I thought this was really important in the story, that part of the reason she was doing this is that she was getting back aches, her neck hurt, you know, she's I've actually having that. spine trouble. It really trouble. does hurt, it, it changes your your posture. posture. Yeah. You, and, and you're also embarrassed, so you tend to roll your shoulders forward. You know, hold your head high, yeah. roll those shoulders back. Do you think that that's partially why the story has resonated so much? Because we do hear stories about girls wanting to enhance, not quite as much are we hearing about girls who are embarrassed. Yeah, I mean, a lot of, of the people who are commenting are saying, you know, that's something I could benefit from or I've done that and it's great to hear you tell the story in just such a, a matter-of-fact way. Mm -hmm. I also think she wanted to talk about this because, listen, the Emmys are coming up. Modern Family is right. nominated. Right. She didn't want to be out there on the red carpet and have the whole conversation be, wait, you what did she different. have yeah. done? Yeah. What is, yeah. What's but, different? But it doesn't have any effect on her acting career. Do you think it does? No, no. no. I mean, it, you know, obviously if it makes her feel great and she feels confident, that can only be good for a your good, career. Yeah. But I don't think she did it because of no, Hollywood. I no. think she did it because 
this was something she personally wanted, which is the only right reason and to do Your boobs, that your event. body, your choice. Yes. yes. No judgment zone. <laughs> yes. But I have, I have to say. <laughs> One way of putting it. I'm going to needle point that on a pillow, Thank by you. the way. <laughs> Thank you. That, yes. That's for you. Yeah. Thank Can you. I point out the issue that it's in? It's mm -hmm. in the September it issue is. of Glamour. You also have a great article with Tig Notaro. Yes. Who is a comedian from Past Christian, and I love the whole, the whole issue this month. Thank you very much. Tig is great, and she's got a great documentary on Netflix right now and an HBO special coming up, so another great thing to pay attention All to. All right. Important work. Great. Always Thanks great when you're here. Thank you.